Hey guys, Mike here. Today we're going to take a look at the Slick case from Acme Made. This is for the iPad. Uh, the description here it says it's a dual, dual use case that protects the device while it's in use and also while on the go. Uh, it has a full size protective pocket for storing your cables and whatnot. And it's made of a unique stretch shell neoprene uh, that's water resistant and stain resistant. And it says it gives uh, some protection while adding minimal bulk. All right, so the MSRP on this is $39.99 and it comes in black and white. And as you can see, we got the white one right here. So let's do a quick little look here before we get the iPad in. Uh, a couple things to know here. First, we have uh, two zippers that go all the way around. Uh, the spine here on the back is a kind of a reinforced neoprene. Uh, this is nice, um, you know, it gives it some some flexibility, so it's not too rigid. So let's say if you want to, you know, if you open it up, it's not going to, you know, come back on you and it's easy to fold over. You're not going to get any resistance however you want to uh, use the case. Um, on the uh, on the inside here, this is black. It's a soft material. A uh, little padding in here. And then right down here, we have some elastic uh, bands here to hook on the iPad. We got four to go around. This is the large pocket for storing stuff right here. Uh, one thing to note on the bottom, this is open. So basically, this is one piece of material fabric, um, and it is padded. You know, put held together with. Uh, um, three little pieces of sort of elastic material and the bottom here is open so if you have something like the camera kit you know maybe the ipad camera kit you know that might slide through you know when you're using it um so really cables adapters a little bit bigger objects that aren't likely to slide through these little these little sections just something i noticed um one thing actually it's kind of interesting is this could actually be a sleeve you could put the ipad right in here if you really i guess wanted to but really it's intended to go over here all right so let's get the ipad in and show you how that looks um, all you gotta do is just put the those little elastic pieces over the corners like so, and there we go. We got the iPad installed. Now, um, you know, a couple other cases I looked at, you know, these this idea of the elastic on the corners caused some problems, but this is a pretty. I guess lightweight material. Um, it's a little bit of cloth with just some elastic in there. So I don't think it's going to cause too much problems, but we'll do a quick little run through on the porch just to give you an idea. Um, here's the speaker. And yeah, it is kind of covering it up. You know, it's actually, you know, up a little bit, you know, on the, the side right there. So it's not right up against the speaker. So I don't think it's going to be that big of a deal in terms of, you know, muffling the, the audio or anything like that. So I won't worry about that. Uh, here's the, uh, the, the uh, dock here for charging or anything you want to do. Up here on the top, we have the audio jack, which is pretty, you know, should be fine. Um, the microphone is uh, covered up, but again, it's held up off, so it's not right up against it, so it shouldn't be an issue. Power button is a little bit off to the side right here, um, but, um, um, you know, you can easily push it through there, so no big deal. And the last one here is the volume rocker is uh, right there, and the toggle switch is covered up, which isn't too big of a deal, but you can just push it out of the way. Like I said, these aren't too rigid, so it's not too big of a deal. It'd be nice maybe if it was a little bit different, but that's basically where, you know, all the stuff is on the iPad if you were to do these corners, so it's just kind of the way it works. So by being a little bit loose on the uh, on the, the elastic here, you know, I don't think it's really that big of an issue. So uh, let's take a look at that. Uh, one thing to note is, as you can see from the logo right here, you know, this is intended to uh, be on the left side, which is a little bit different. The right side is a little more conventional with the folio style cases. Um, you usually have your pad of paper here or something, so that's pretty natural, but no big deal. You know, you can always just use it like so if you wanted to. It's no big deal. So uh, a couple other things to know here on the external material here. Um, this is a, yeah, this is a very smooth uh, material. You can see it uh, has a pretty good gloss to it as I catch the lights. Uh, definitely going to be water resistant and you're going to have some stain resistance on this too. Uh, nothing should really stick on this thing. So there you go, guys. A look at the slick case from Acme Made. This is Mike from Insanely Great Mac. Thanks for watching.